Hi there, it's Galen, design team member with Unity Stamp Company. Today I'm going to show a set of four mini note cards in watercolor along with a little handmade uh, gift box for those. Um, I also made some optional handmade envelopes for these cards. I know you can buy small three by three inch cards, but I went ahead and made some of those just extra for this. I'm using Unity Stamp Company kit called Heart of Autumn. It's the August 2020 sentiment kit. I'm using the heart and two of the larger sentiments for this. And so I cut the panels for the box and I assembled the box using extra tacky uh, score tape. And then I uh, die cut using a slim die, a slim or tall die. Um, I, I die cut, but you can use a paper trimmer to trim those mini card panels. And I also cut squares to fit onto the mini cards and onto the box itself. So for the box, I'm stamping onto the, to the two larger panels of squares. I'm using the heart. Uh, the heart design it's beautiful and I heat set that in white onto watercolor paper and then I'm going to use stamping onto the small squares also using the mini misty versamark ink and um, I heat set that with uh, white embossing powder and I do that for each I do two uh, stampings of the thanks and two of the hello um, sentiments to get four total card fronts for those mini cards and then he said that it looks real pretty i mixed all the new watercolors um, a gold color a darker teal and a lighter teal and so i just use a wide paintbrush and swipe a wide just one swipe line all the way across um, on each of the cards in yellow i just want to go one color at a time and do those swipes wherever those that that color is needed so i did it uh, six times so four for the mini cards and two for the card box and so now i'm going through and adding the darker teal towards the bottom letting it blend in with the yellow um, and then you know you can use different colors i chose to keep them all the same type of color um, they're not exactly perfect but it's watercolor and watercolor is not perfect and I just love the way it looks after it's dry and so then I go and add the lighter color of teal towards the top of each of those cards card fronts and um, just swipe it again letting it blend in with that yellow a little bit it actually turns more green because mostly because of the yellow but that's fine um, you get different looks every time. It's no, it's never the same twice with watercolor. That's the beauty of it. I love it that way. And so there you go. I'm just adding two more swipes um, onto those, onto the top portion of each of those panels. And you can keep going. Um, you can add as little or more, however you like, whatever you like for the watercolor. And so after that is finished, you allow it to dry or heat set it, each of those panels to make sure it's real dry before we start assembling everything. So now I put this um, box together by using extra tacky score tape. And then uh, well, you can use a pre-existing mini gift bag if you have it and add a panel to the front of a mini gift bag that's already existing. And so I go ahead and add a heart panel to the front and back of that box and um, on to the mini cards I add this uh, watercolor sentiment uh, card fronts to each of those just to finish and I also die cut and assembled some envelopes to go with this set and so it all fits right into that little card box just perfectly. I hope you like this. Take a moment to subscribe to my channel. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.